New on the four, we are keeping our focus on school safety this week. We first told you Monday all Walker County schools are getting weapons detectors. Well, today, Dora High School got theirs. Now, our Tristan Rupert is live now on your side to give us this update. That's right, Sarah. They've been putting this into practice since Monday. Today, we're really getting an update on what they're doing and how the technology is working at Dora in particular. Uh, I spoke with their principal, Paige Abner. She says their team has gotten more efficient each and every day at getting students through the weapon detectors in a timely manner, but they've also got theirs on the most sensitive setting, which is different than perhaps other schools in the area. They're doing this to get students used to it, more acclimated and more aware of what the technology is capable of, which means right now the technology, the weapon detectors aren't just picking up potential knives or guns. They can also pick up vapes. As you know, it's something that's grown in frequency and usage among the teenage demographic over the years. It's been a problem in school districts, including Walker counties in past years. And upon learning that this new technology can also pick up vapes, several students actually tossed theirs in the trash prior to entering school this week. Vaping is a real issue amongst our young people and uh, we want to prevent uh, the damage that's being done to their bodies as much as possible. So definitely putting on those settings every once in a while is going to be beneficial to everyone. Principal Abner also stresses the portable nature of these devices is a real benefit for the district. She says they plan on rolling these out to ball games, even bringing them to certain classrooms if they're given a tip or perhaps anything out of the ordinary pops up on their radar. Reporting on Walker County, Tristan Rupert, WBRC, Fox 6 News, on your side.